Hey there folks, today's battle is, an, is a PU tier battle, and man did I miss out on an opportunity. Last month, Smogon made PU a uh, supported metagame on the uh, Pokemon Showdown server for one glorious month. They do this once a month with a different metagame, and PU was the uh, the other metagame of the month last month, and it would have been give, it would have given me a great opportunity to test out uh, variations on my team because I had to do modifications from the last time you saw this team because I lost Superior uh, to NU from the last um, PU tier update. So what I did was I took out Superior and I took out Mr. Mime who was never doing well, and I put on Behem in, in its place for uh, Mr. Mime, and then to replace Superior I put on uh, this Meganium, which is a good deal bulkier. It uh, doesn't have the speed, but it still has the Reflect Light Screen, and then Leech Seed is its only attacking move. The final move is Aromatherapy, which works great considering I have um, Lanoon, who doesn't like getting um, paralyzed or uh, or burned, and I've got Zuelus, who gets crippled by a burn. So having a, having a Cleric on this team, I think, is a really good idea. Here, I predict the switch out into Muck and go for the Reflect. Um, knowing that Muck is almost always a physical attacker. If you're not running uh, Muck as a physical attacker, I don't know what you're doing. And now I go out into Morena, um, my camera up, knowing that I can hit him with a super effective um, earth power. Here he goes for the substitute, and really I should have just broken the substitute on this turn. Um, he goes for the focus punch. As I go from the Stealth Rock, just thinking, uh, I was actually thinking that he might just straight up switch out and sacrifice the sub, but no, he goes for the Focus Punch, so it's a, it's a sub punch set, but I do the Calc and see that shouldn't be too big of a deal, and I'm like, what the hell happened there? A crit. So the crit bypassed the Reflect, doubled the damage, and got the KO, and that is awful. Now I'm going to go out into Diana, my uh, Behe. And I figure that, you know, Psychic will obviously break the sub. It's, uh, this is a slightly... I don't think I've ever run Behem on a battle I put on YouTube, but I did actually have another Behem I bred months ago. But this one is a new breed because it's got Analytic, which means if it goes second, then it its power increases by all, I think, almost as much as Life Orb, if not the amount of Life Orb. Here I make a really bad play. I was thinking that he'd switch out wanting to save his muck. Instead, he goes for the Poison Jab as I go for the Nasty Plot. So... Oh my god, awful play, awful play, and that's going to cost me my begging, which is slower than this muck. Um, not only that, he probably has the Shadow Sneak, so he would have been able to take me out anyway. Goes for the Poison Jab, gets a useless crit there, and Diana goes down. So that was a crucial misplay on my part, and I feel stupid for having made it. Now I go out into my Zuelus. And he actually decides to switch out here. I see that he's got no steel type, so I figure go for the outrage. Should be good against no matter who he sends out. And as long as he doesn't miss that is, because you know the, the downside of hustle boosting the attack power is that the accuracy drops like 20%. So go for the outrage. Uh it's gonna be a two-hit KO against his Meganium. His Meganium is gonna have the opportunity to set up a leech seed, and so now I'm just really hoping that uh it does, the outrage doesn't miss. It doesn't miss, and um Meganium is going to go down thanks to a useless crit, uh, and I'm only going to get two turns of Outrage, which blows, uh, and my Reflect wears off this turn. So now he's going to go back out into Muck, so that's not going to give me an opportunity to set up. Um, so basically I decide here I'm going to stay in and go for the Outrage because my only hope is that I'm able to hit him before he sets up his sub, otherwise it's just a bad situation all around, and unfortunately I hit myself in the confusion. Now I... You know, Fraggle is doing work. I do not want to just sack it to a focus punch, even if it does mean I can break his sub. So I'm going to go out into Starbuck. My Scarfed Waylord uh, should be able to take a focus punch. I will put up the calcs to show it can take a focus punch uh, from this muck. So he goes ahead and goes for the focus punch, and as you might have already guessed, uh, Starbuck does not survive this hit because he gets another crit. So. You know, he's, apo he's apologizing in the battle chat, and I'm like, it's the game, you know, if I didn't want crits, I would play chess. So, I figure, well, how am I going to deal with this muck now? i got to sacrifice Lanoon uh, by just going for the extreme speed to break the sub. And I hope it can break the sub, I don't know how bulky this thing is physically, um, and, you know, Lanoon's not that great of an attacker without its belly drum, so I take out his sub, as he goes for the focus punch, it's obviously going to KO Lanoon, I mean, that wasn't even a question. But now, his sub is down, and there's a slim, slim possibility that I will be able to take out this monk. Um, 
So, and that, that way, you know, if I do that, then at least it won't be a body bag. So I go back out into Fraggle. Fraggle's down to 50% health less, actually. So I'm going to go for the Outrage and just hope it KOs and health goes down, down, down. And it's looking hopeful. And he survives on just a smidgen. Uh, goes for the Poison Jab. It gets me down to a smidgen. And uh, here he goes for the Shadow Sneak, but I'm like, okay, I resist it. I have the Violate, and indeed I survive. Unfortunately, at that level of health, I'm not going to be able to switch out thanks to the fact that rocks are up. So no matter what happens here, you know, Muck goes down. Uh, uh, I get confused, to, so again, only two turns of confusion. But as you're about to see, it doesn't really matter because out now is going to come his heat more. Um, well, actually, no, it does. It's so yeah, it didn't matter that I only got two turns of outrage. I couldn't have switched out. Um, he. Uh, because of the health, and you know, he sucker punched me anyway, so it's not like I got hit by the confusion again. So that's unfortunate. I'm down to my last Pokemon who is weak to fire type moves, and it doesn't matter because I don't have any attacking moves on this set besides Leech Seed, and he would have had to do him as a whole lot of fire blasts in order for me to take him out. So Deb goes down, and this battle is lost 4 2, which is sad, sad, sad. So now you're not going to see another PU battle until the PU tier is updated once again. Hopefully, nothing moves. So long, folks.